Here comes the assistant now. Accompanied by the Defence Secretary, Mr. Nott. Ladies and gentlemen, the Secretary of State for Defence has just come over to give me some very good news, and I think you'd like to have it at once. The uh, message we've got is that British troops landed on South Georgia this afternoon, shortly after 4 p.m. London time. They have now successfully taken control of Gritviken. At about 6 p.m. London time, the white flag was hoisted in Gritviken beside the Argentine flag, and shortly afterwards, the Argentine forces there surrendered to British forces. The Argentine forces offered only limited resistance to the British troops. Our forces were landed by helicopter and were supported by a number of warships, together with a Royal Fleet Auxiliary. During the first phase of this operation, our own helicopters engaged the Argentine submarine Santa Fe off South Georgia. This submarine was detected at first light and was engaged because it posed a threat to our men and to the British warships launching the landing. So far, no British casualties have been reported. At present, we have no information on the Argentine casualty position. The commander of the operation has sent the following message. Be pleased to inform Her Majesty that the White Ensign flies alongside the Union Jack in South Georgia. God save the Queen. What happens next, what, Mr. Nott? Yeah. Thank you very much. What's your reaction, Just rejoice at that news and congratulate our forces and the Marines. Are we going Good to night, declare gentlemen. more Argentina?